right. Thank you guys for showing up. We're going to be talking about, uh, Aliyah is going to be talking about perception. So take it away. Okay, thank you. Um, so I'm Alaya. Um, I, I live in Vermont. And um, I'm really happy to be part of this show. I'm really impressed with the quality of the work. And I'm just um, honored to be part of the group. Um, so this painting is um, it's acrylic paint, pastel, and some collage, which is pretty typical of my work. Um, I work in a lot of layers, and I often don't know <laughs> what, what the end result's going to be, um, mm. and that was true of this painting, and, and that's part of the really probably my favorite part of painting is that sort of mystery that happens. Um, and the balance between controlling what I want and then letting go and letting emerge what wants to emerge. Um, and this one, it's really true about this painting because I started this painting as um, part of a series I'm working on about that's inspired by Jonah and the whale. And most of them are, you know, have water in them, obviously. And this painting became something that really wasn't about that. And it, mm -hmm. it um, really was about uh, the different kinds of perception that I feel like we have. So um, the, you can see maybe the brown head on the right-hand side, and there's these um, small perception lines, and in, in the middle there's a tiny ship. You have to get pretty close to see that, but mm. that um, to me represents uh, the perception that we have as children for child consciousness, where we don't have a lot of agency in our lives um, or power in our lives, so things we perceive in a certain way. We also don't have a lot of knowledge about the world. So we see things in a very specific um, way that can sometimes, you know, not be exactly in, in reality. And then on the left, there's a ship coming in um, in the sky area. And to me, that represents adult consciousness, where we do have agency and we do have um, power in our lives and the power to choose. And even as we're adults, we um, go back and forth between child consciousness and adult consciousness. So it's kind of the interplay of those two things. And then um, the watercolor eye that's collaged in the center of the horizon that really pulls the viewer into the painting, to me, is either you know the idea of an all-seeing God or spirit um, which is kind of a remnant from my exploration of the Jonah story. But mm -hmm. even more to me is like the witness um, perception that we develop from practices like meditation, where we observe our thoughts, we observe our feelings, and um, or we observe the events in our lives and don't get as caught in them. And mm -hmm. then... Um, I think the fact that it's an agrarian scene to me, um, you know, when I was like looking at it afterwards and trying to figure out, oh, what, what, what happened? You know, what, what is this meaning? Why is it so agrarian? Is that um, these perceptions and developing kind of a higher level of perception is something that we grow and change um, throughout our lives. It's not a fixed thing. And so, you know, therefore, the different seasons in the, in the fields and, and the, the evolution of that. So, um, so that was my thinking behind um, the painting that I just wanted to share with you. And, um, you know, I'm happy to answer any questions you have about what I said or about my process or really anything that you want to ask if you have any questions. It's really beautiful. I thank you so much for sh sharing the the process and the you really do a beautiful